Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to share with you um, the Santa bag box from KS Craft. Uh, this came out in October, so this is the October release. And um, I'm just now getting to all those projects, some really fun die sets in this, um, this newest release. So um, the Santa bag box is so stinking cute. I wanna real quick show you, um, here's the die set. You do get two pieces to um, create the front and back. So you have your main piece here and then your layering piece. And if you can see there, both have stitching on them. So I really like that detail, like with the double stitching. Um, you have this piece here, or excuse me, these two pieces. That creates your bottom and then you have your layering piece. And again, both of those have stitches. Um, you have the sides, so there's two pieces to the sides, um, and again, both with that stitching and then that layering piece. So, um, yeah, that's what allows, if you guys can see that close up, but you're going to have your stitching there. You've got stitching on the sides and the same with the bottom. Um, you do have this really sweet, it's actually a tiny bow and this will be, you can use this all year round. So really, really cute. I uh, covered most of the bow up, but you can see it here. It's really, really cute. Um, there is this little truck, adorable. I haven't made him yet, but super cute little truck. It even has like your layering pieces. Um, so if you want your windows to be like blue, you could do the base piece in blue, you do like your truck in like red or something. It'd be really cute. Um, and then it has even the wheels that you can layer on there. Comes with these really cute trees, um, which, where did I? I just, where did it go? Oh, here we go. Um, so that's what one of the trees looks like. I just popped it up on foam. Um, but you do get three sizes, so that's, I think that's really cute. And then this flower set is amazing. So that's what I decorated this with. Um, you do get three sizes, and then you even get a center. I didn't use the centerpiece, but I love this die set. So really, really cute. Makes a really cute poinsettia. Um, so that's this die set. Here is the most adorable little Santa bag. Um, it's really big too, you guys. So, you know, I never remember to bring down my, um, measuring, you know, my ruler, but, um, yeah, this is pretty good size and it's really deep. So, um, it can fit quite a bit of stuff in it. I think this would be really, really cute with just like some sweet treats, some candies, like chocolates or something, um, and put them in like a cellophane bag and kind of tie the bag and have part of the bag sticking out. Um, I think it'd be really, really cute, but I did want to just put some things in here just to kind of show you that it holds a lot. Um, but there are those flowers, aren't those amazing? So, uh, real quick shout out to Buttons Galore and more. Um, they gifted me these little gold balls. Those came in the um, uh, October subscription box. So um, lots of fun Christmas items in that box. Um, whoops, so if, if they aren't sold out, it would be a good time to subscribe so that you can um, get this, this, this little box um, because there's so many like fun things in that um, subby box. Um, but yeah, it made the perfect center to these flowers. Like how amazing. And then I use, these are the little, um, the little greenery that came in, I think it's the September release with Chaos Craft. So there was um, the little holly leaf set and I just use those to um, add some additional greenery to my flowers. But yeah, I love, love, love. I love the shape of the, the Santa sack. I love that it looks like it's cinched in. I mean, this thing is just so adorable. Um, now I'll take everything out and I'll show you that in a second, but I want you to see um, just kind of how big this is. So look at how much room there is. So I love that um, KS Craft designed this to, you know, be really open. So even though these are narrower, you know, this is still something you can add lots and lots to. And then um, there's that layering piece there. So really lets you kind of decorate this up. And there's the bottom. 
but isn't this just so cute? Oh my gosh, so darling. So I just added, I think I showed you guys these before. I've added them to other projects, but just two fun sequin mixes that I put in these little plastic um, containers. Thought that would be fun to add in there. I added um, another one of these little um, lanterns. So that's from this set here. So it's the lantern shaker set that came out in October as well. Um, you can create um, a see-through lantern, or if you use this piece here, you can have a backing to your lantern. So um, you can do it either way. And I didn't use the snowflake, but uh, that is like super cute. Um, but yeah, so here's the lantern. I do show this on a, another video, um, but I use another one of these um, Christmas poinsettias from the September release and the tulip edge flower from the uh, September release. So I use those there and um, I really kept it pretty simple. I didn't want this to be overly embellished because I really feel like the sequins are kind of the star of the show. This is like the perfect little um, holder for those. Um, and I just really love the size of this and just that, that it's kind of, you know, just a silhouette of um, that lantern so really really cute i just added a little bead mix or excuse me a little charm uh, mix to that little container and then um i shared the other set on a previous video but let me show you these so this release um, the october release came with um a huge oh my gosh everything's falling apart a huge word christmas word set so it's um there's three separate sets it's the christmas shadow words and you get um like there's one set here one set here and then on the back everything's falling off but there's another set um it's just so many fun words in this set so i'll show you those um really quickly um oh my gosh you guys i keep saying um i don't need to do that Okay, so here is one of the sets. Uh, it's a really sweet font, and these are like perfect size. So perfect size to embellish your projects. So you have sweater, um, cocoa, weather. So I like, you know, sweater weather, um, cold. Um, oh, I love that. Hot cocoa, whoops, winter, uh, snow, and time. So... Super cute, like you could do winter time on a project. Really, really cute. Love those. And then the other set. There's snowflakes. So let me move those up a little. We've got snowflakes, fa la la, North Pole, uh, rejoice, peace, and hope super cute and then i'll show you i showed these already but i'm going to show them to you again just so you can see the sets together you've got milk um and cookies so push those up a little bit milk and cookies uh, mistletoe carols super cute um snow or stockings and then carolers so isn't this font, like, let me just show you some of these close up. This font is just amazing. Here we go. And I just love the size. I just really, really love the size of the, of this set. So you could easily do like, let's see if that one, like if I wanted to add like a word to this, I could have put like hope, hope on there. Um, peace, you know, it's just like if I had, didn't have that flower there, I think that would be really cute um, to add to like your smaller embellishments. So um, what a fun set. So anyway, you guys, that's it. Just wanted to share with you those few new um, sets. This is, I feel like a must have. I don't know. I just love it so much. I know it's pretty Christmassy. Like um, I love sets that you can kind of use maybe a little bit more but i also love to have some really fun um gift giving ho like holiday specific sets and i think this is one of them um this is big enough to fit like a small candle inside 
um, and like some chocolates, you know, for like your coworkers and teachers and things. So really, really fun. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed that. If you have any questions at all, um, just please leave them in the comments below. Um, I would love to hear like what was kind of your favorite from this little, um, project I did. And then also, um, you can find all of Chaos Craft Dyes on AliExpress and on Amazon. So um, definitely check them out in both of those places. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you on the next video. Bye.